world frozen in time where the cherry blossoms never fall and the leaves never crunch underfoot, where we never transition from the sweltering heat of summer to the brisk chill of autumn, or from the frosty bite of winter to the budding life of spring. It's a reality that seems almost alien, yet it's a question that sparks curiosity and invites exploration. Today, we embark on a journey, a journey to understand the implications of an Earth devoid of seasons. We'll delve into the heart of what makes our planet tick and examine the potential consequences of such a dramatic shift. This isn't just a whimsical thought experiment. It's a scientific investigation into the fabric of our world. So, strap in, keep an open mind, and prepare for a deep dive into the unknown. Now let's dive into the science behind this fascinating question. To understand the implications of a seasonless Earth, we first need to grasp why we have seasons in the first place. Our Earth, this beautiful blue marble, is not perfectly upright as it journeys around the Sun. Instead, it leans at an angle of about 23 and a half degrees, a characteristic we call tilt. This tilt remains constant as the Earth makes its annual trip around the Sun, causing different parts of the Earth to receive different amounts of sunlight throughout the year. When the North Pole tilts towards the Sun, it's summer in the Northern Hemisphere. The days are long, the Sun is high in the sky, and the temperatures are warm. Conversely, when the North Pole tilts away from the Sun, it's winter in the Northern Hemisphere with shorter days, lower Sun, and cooler temperatures. Meanwhile, the Southern Hemisphere experiences the opposite, when it's summer up north, it's winter down south, and vice versa. In between these extremes, we have spring and autumn, transitional periods where the tilt is neither towards nor away from the sun, resulting in moderate temperatures and roughly equal day and night lengths. Now let's talk about the Earth's orbit. Our planet doesn't orbit the sun in a perfect circle, but rather in a slightly elongated path known as an ellipse. This means that the Earth's distance from the sun changes slightly throughout the year. However, contrary to what some may think, this variation has a much smaller impact on our seasons than the Earth's tilt. So, in a nutshell, our Earth's tilt and its journey around the Sun create the ebb and flow of seasons, the variations in temperature, and the dance between daylight and darkness that we experience throughout the year. It's a delicate balance, a cosmic ballet choreographed by the laws of physics and celestial mechanics. So, now that we understand why we have seasons, what would happen if this cycle was suddenly taken away? Imagine a world where winter never comes. Sounds great, right? But let's think about the implications. Now, we often grumble about the cold, the snow, the ice. But a world without winter would be far from an endless summer vacation. Let's start with the ecosystems that rely on a period of cold and dormancy. Many of our planet's trees, for instance, require a chilling period to trigger spring growth. Without this cold spell, they wouldn't know when to break dormancy, disrupting the natural cycle of life. This could lead to a decline in tree populations and subsequently, a decrease in the oxygen we breathe. Similarly, many animals have adapted to hibernate during winter. Hibernation isn't just a long nap, it's a survival strategy. It allows animals to conserve energy during food shortage periods. Without winter, these animals may not get the cue to hibernate, leading to a potential overuse of resources and a disruption in the food chain. Insect populations too are kept in check by winter's frosty grip. Without it, Pests such as mosquitoes and ticks could flourish year-round, leading to increased transmission of diseases like malaria and Lyme disease. Our agriculture would also be affected. Many of our most consumed crops, like wheat and apples, need a period of cold to yield a good harvest. Without winter, we might see a decrease in food production, leading to potential food shortages. And let's not forget the human impact. Many cultures and economies depend on winter. Think of winter tourism like skiing, ice fishing, and snowboarding. And what about the joy of a white Christmas, the thrill of a snowball fight, or the quiet beauty of a snow-covered landscape? So, while it may be tempting to fantasize about a world without winter, the reality could be quite different. The balance of life on Earth is a delicate one, and every season plays its crucial part. So it seems that a world without winter could have some serious consequences. Now what about a world without summer? How would that affect us? Let's delve into this intriguing question. Imagine a world where the sun's rays never intensify, where the warmth of summer never arrives. The first thing that comes to mind is the impact on agriculture and food production. Our agricultural systems are finely tuned to the rhythm of the seasons. They rely on the summer's warmth and extended daylight hours for crops to grow and thrive. Without the summer season, 
crops like corn, wheat, and rice, which are staples in diets worldwide, would struggle to mature. The lack of sunlight and heat could stunt their growth, leading to lower yields. This could potentially cause a global food shortage, affecting billions of people worldwide. Moreover, a lack of summer would also disrupt the pollination process. Many plants rely on the summer bloom to attract pollinators. Without this crucial season, we could see a decline in biodiversity, impacting not only our food supply, but also the health of our ecosystems. But the effects of a world without summer go beyond agriculture. Summer's warm weather and long days also have a significant impact on our mood and behavior. The sunlight triggers the release of serotonin in our brains, the hormone associated with boosting mood and helping a person feel calm and focused. Without the regular dose of summer sunshine, we could see a rise in mood disorders and a general decline in mental well-being. Just imagine, no more summer barbecues, no more beach trips, no more basking in the warm golden glow of a summer afternoon. Our recreational activities, our social habits, and even our cultural practices that are tied to this sunny season would be forever altered. So what does all this tell us? Well, it highlights just how integral summer is to our world, not just for the natural processes that sustain life, but for our psychological well-being too. It's clear that a world without summer could also be challenging. This underlines the importance of the delicate balance that our planet maintains and the intricate interconnectedness of life on Earth. So, we've seen the potential problems with a world without winter or summer. But what about the bigger picture? Let's take a step back and look at the grand scheme. The cycle of seasons isn't just a series of transitions we mark on our calendars. It's a driving force behind the Earth's climate systems, influencing everything from the rhythmic dance of ocean currents to the ever-shifting patterns of winds. Take ocean currents, for instance. These vast rivers in the sea help distribute heat around the globe. They are partially driven by changes in water temperature and salinity, which are, in turn, influenced by seasonal changes. If we remove seasons, we disrupt this delicate balance potentially leading to drastic changes in our climate. Then there's the wind. If you've ever flown a kite, you've felt the power of the wind. But did you know that the wind patterns are heavily influenced by the sun's heat? Just as with ocean currents, the sun's heat is not evenly distributed throughout the year due to the tilt of our planet. This uneven heating gives rise to wind patterns, which in turn affect weather systems. Without seasons, these patterns could change dramatically with unforeseeable consequences. But it's not just about weather. Seasons also play a crucial role in the distribution of life on Earth. Many species, both plant and animal, have adapted to the rhythm of the seasons. They rely on the changing conditions to trigger behaviors such as migration, hibernation, and reproduction. Without seasons, these natural cycles would be thrown into chaos. And let's not forget about us, humans. Our agricultural practices, cultural traditions, even our moods, are tied to the ebb and flow of seasons. Imagine a world with no autumn harvest festivals, no winter holidays, no spring weddings or summer vacations. So, although it might seem appealing to imagine a world without the extremes of winter or summer, the reality is that our seasons are an integral part of life on Earth. As we've learned today, the Earth's seasons are not just a backdrop to our lives, but a fundamental part of the planet's life support system. We've taken a deep dive into the science of seasons, Understanding how the Earth's tilt on its axis and its journey around the Sun bring about these cyclical changes. We've imagined the implications of a world without winter, where the joys of snowfall and the necessity of a period of rest and rejuvenation for many species are absent. And we've considered a world without summer, devoid of the warmth and abundance that this season brings. Through these reflections, we've come to appreciate the broader importance of the seasonal cycle, recognizing its role in sustaining life, driving weather patterns, and shaping our human cultures and activities.